No, I'm, I'm sure it's just uh, Nepa. You know how they behave. Yeah. 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 So you can just drop them here. Um, I'm sure my mother's waiting for you already. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So do you have uh, money on you? Because uh, yes, I don't think I have any. I do. You know, your mother gave me a lot of money. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. So I'm, I'm coming to the house tomorrow. So when I come, I will still sort you out, okay? All right, thanks for today, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, all right. Thanks. All right, I'll see you. Have a nice day, yeah? All right. What is this? Something was wrong with the electric gas. What the fuck is going on here? Something is not right, or I'm not right. Something is definitely not right. Take my drugs.
Hello, son. You got me worried. What happened? My mom, it's, um, today's been undoubtedly a, a very bad day. Very hectic, too. For a long story short, I'm going to come see you first in the morning. Are you okay? Are you safe? Yeah, I'm fine. It's just that I'm very hungry. I had to help myself with some junk. But I guess when I come to your house tomorrow, I'm going to eat a lot of food, right? Okay, you sure will. Okay, be safe, huh? I love you. I love you too. Come on, Laszlo, pick your call. Pick. Expecting your call since morning. My, my, my brother, I don't have a courtesy, okay? Look, I, I, I think I have a housemate in this house with me. There's a ghostly figure in this house. I need you to come to this house right now. Bro, it's 12 midnight. You can't leave my house right now. I might be dead by then! But didn't you tell me your doctor took care of this hallucination thing? Why didn't you just take your drugs? Look, I know what I'm saying, okay? I saw a ghost. I saw it clearly. There's a ghost in this house, my brother, please. No, Daddy, I'll see you tomorrow morning, okay? What? That's not. I saw something pass. I, 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 I saw it. Okay. I think I need my sleeping pills. I need my sleeping pills. I need my sleeping pills. Something is, something is not right in this house. I'm telling you, every day it's just. Is everything okay, brotherly? Everyone was 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 was, was, was scattered. I am just coming with you. Look at this. Are you okay? 
No, are you okay? You know what? Uh, see, I want to sell this house. Okay. I want to move from here. They have to show me in, uh, in, in, in the stream. Yeah. I want to move there as soon as possible. But this house is possible. Slow down, slow down, bro. But you see, Avalon, that house is gone already. Did you show me the house last week? Yeah, but we sealed the deal about four days ago, so it's gone. Anyways, you are an expert, right? So, I mean, it's really hard for you to find another house. But I need to leave this place. So, get me another house. Move the podcast. I don't mind adding extra money. I want to move. I Relax. Move Calm down, Avalon, okay? That would take us about a month to get you a house, okay? Are you okay? A month? Yes, Avalon, okay? Just take it easy. By then, I'll be dead. Look, I think you're just being stressed from yesterday. But you see, it will never happen again. What I think I would do for you is get you a house help that can stay with you in this big mansion. Okay? Okay, okay. But look, you need to arrange the buyer for this house because as soon as I get you another house, I have to move out from here. I need to sell it. That's not a problem. That's no problem. But in the meantime, I think you should just go and shower, okay? So we can um, get something to eat. Mama's boy. The motherless ones like us. Now, what are we supposed to do? Hmm? You have a wife, right? Mm hmm. Yeah. <laughs> um. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Jesus! Mom, is this supposed to be breakfast or something? This looks too much for breakfast. When last did you eat from your mother's pot? Eat and get filled. Mm. <laughs> Anyways, I'll pack some of them home and I can microwave them at my convenience and eat and get belly full. Mm, that's not going to last for long. <laughs> but the main reason we asked you to come home is for you to get married and have someone that will be doing this in the house. Not for you to come to your mother's house and pack food and go to your house and... Okay, barista, Mrs. Samantha. I will just do that. Mm. Mm -hmm. I got mm. you two beautiful girls, son. One is a doctor, the other one a lawyer. They are from good families, and I know you will like them. Well, opposite, opposite, opposite to what your son would like. Mom, look, if I need a lawyer, I have you, right? And if I need a wife, I would go and look for them myself, and I'll bring them to you. All right? So why don't you excite me once I'm in my father's company while I've been away? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. You know, it was clearly stated in that... Well, that they shouldn't mm. let you have any information in there except you settle down with a wife mm. before they could open it and give you all the details in that will. So don't even expect to have or get any information from me. I won't tell you anything until you get your wife. All right. Mm -hmm. No problem. So can I eat my food now and when I'm done eating, I can go look for a wife for you? Hmm? Okay. By the way, Mom, can you help me with some cold juice? I'll get the juice for now, but you know it's not um, in my place to do that. You should get a wife that will be doing all these things for me. Well, I'm not asking you as a wife. I'm asking you as my mother, and it's your responsibility to make sure that your son does not choke while eating your food. Maybe I'll just say, you don't choke, you choke, you choke, you choke. Yeah, it's me. Hmm? Are you even talking too much? There's pepper in that rice you're taking. <coughs> okay, drink water, son. Ah, uh, give me juice. <laughs> Tell me, how is your day going to be? Well, from here, I'm supposed to meet up with uh, Lancelot. We have the games, and after that, I would go home, take a cold shower, then uh, sleep. Oh, yeah, I'll microwave the remaining food I'll take from here. Why not come back here instead of taking the food there to microwave on your own? <laughs> I can see you're already missing your deputy husband. <laughs> well, I wish I could come back, but um, Lancelot is helping me get the domestic staff to help me run the house affair, so I have to go and assess the person myself. It's okay, you do have a nice day and enjoy yourself. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Mm. Mm -hmm. Just eat. Then, choose. Don't worry. Don't worry, I will. Mom. See, get someone that will be doing this for you. Get a wife. Mom, mom, hold juice. Okay, let me go and get you a juice. She's pouring juice. Mm -hmm. 
Don't tell me it's only type of juice. Mortuary standard, please. God bless you as you do it. I will be back. I love you. Love you too, baby. Oh, sure. Oh, I came to the gym. Yeah. So did you check? Did you check? So what happened? Oh, okay. That's fine. It's okay. Yeah, I'll just um, gym for a while and I'll come with you. Hello? Hello? Shit. My phone. Is it okay? I oh, know, my battery. My battery oh. went down. Oh. I have a power bank in my car, and if you. Oh, yes. you do? Yeah. Oh, fine, that'll be good. Yeah. Um, anyone ever told you you look like Cleopatra? You're on the Nollywood uh, actress? Yeah, get that a lot. Oh, yes, yeah, a lot of common features. <laughs> yeah. Um, the, the power bank? Yeah, the power bank. Um, just a minute, right? Okay, yeah. Yeah, but, um, I, I don't have the cable. I don't know. Do you have one? Yeah, I do. I have one in my car. Oh, fine. Okay. Yeah, I'll just right. use the one in my car and then. All right. I'll just I'll just wait, wait here for you then. All right, no problem, sir. All right. All right. Oh my goodness, she's so beautiful. Why didn't I exchange contacts? I mean, she took my power bank, but I don't mind. I can buy another one. How am I going to see her again? Sign. 
said, I'm seeing the signs. I saw it clearly. I saw it clearly. But yeah, I, 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 I couldn't make the face, but I saw it clearly. Yes. I go, bro, I, 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 I need to change this house. I need to get a new house. Don't you want me to come in? Yes, sure. Um, it is, it is this way. Welcome to my, to my small hut. Please, please sit. A small hut? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. How can you call this place a small hut? Um, do you mind wine? Oh, yeah. Red wine? Anything. All right. Anything. Please, be, be, be comfortable. Okay. So um, how did you how did you locate me? Um, first of all, let me apologize for what happened the other day. I mean, I was so engrossed on the long call, and then your power bank it really helped me. Oh. So. <laughs> yeah, you I'm, can have like, it. You can, you can you can have it back. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm I, I can glad, have it. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm really glad that you um, thank you. You found me. <laughs> yeah. So, um, cheers to new friendship. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, so I'm really, I'm, I'm, I'm really glad that you, you found me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, how did you find my address, though? <laughs> Come on. You wrote your name and address at the exit and entrance roster. Yeah. And besides, <laughs> you are identified as a non-member of the Road Trust Club. So, yeah. I traced you from there. <laughs> You're very smart. <laughs> You're very smart. I mean, you've earned my respect, I must say. <laughs> but it's really nice, um, really nice seeing you again, I must say. <laughs> really, really nice. Beautiful place. Well, you're more beautiful than before. <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs>
They're beautiful. Thank you. Innocently beautiful. Thank you, Hansen. Hey mom, you sent for me. Yes, son. Yeah. So what is going on? How do you mean? The main reason we asked you to come back home is for you to choose among the girls we picked for you. Until now, you've not picked anyone and neither have you presented anyone. So what exactly is going on with you? Mom, I told you I'm working on it. I'm talking to someone already, you know, and we're getting along just fine. Okay, tell me about her. Well, there's nothing to know about her. She's a nice girl, and you will see her as soon as possible. In fact, as quick as possible. So please, just calm down, Mom, okay? I hope you know that whoever this girl is must go through my assessment. That's it. I have a meeting to, uh, to meet up with. Can I go now? Yes. Take care of yourself. Have a nice day. Be careful, son. You too. So, why did you... I mean, why did you choose this place out of every other place we could have gone to? Okay. Um, let's say I actually wanted somewhere out of people's sight. Oh. I see. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, why, why did you bring one glass? I don't understand. Are you blind? Can't you see someone here with me? Why are you bringing one glass? Come. Um, honey, it's okay. We can as well do it. No, baby, it's not okay. My friend, get another glass. Come. There's someone here. What's wrong with you? I'm sorry, man. I don't, I don't understand. What's wrong with this people? What? What is it? <laughs> I like your guts. Why did you do that? I don't know. I feel you will like it. I love it. Oh, you do? I like it too. You are as blind as love. Please enjoy your drinks, ma'am. Thank you. I don't understand. What's wrong with him? It's okay. Look, I'm so, so, so sorry. These people just behave funny in this country. I mean, someone is here sitting down and he's, he's dropping two glasses here. Enough to know that I'm in love with her and she's madly in love with me. In fact, you know what's left? We need to go get married immediately. I see. Anyway, just be careful. You just have to be careful if you're sure of her. Are you trying to abandon me? Yes. <laughs> That's not good. So, because you got married yesterday, you now feel you can advise me? Look at this one. Even if I got married this morning, I got married before you. Now, uh, sit down. Are you still interested in? Changing the house? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm okay. I'm okay, okay, you're keeping it? Yeah. Uh, okay. All right. 
<laughs> Avalon, you really, really surprise me, honestly. Today you want to change the house, tomorrow you don't want to add it. You need to find the decision. Honey, how long are we going to keep doing this? How long? Must we keep arguing about the same issue each and every day? Oh yes, I know I'm going to see your mother. But baby, you know I'm indisposed. Of course you know I'm a busy person. I have a lot of engagements to do. Just, just tell her I'll see her anyways, one of those days. I don't like this. Honestly speaking, I don't like this at all. Uh, really? You don't like it? And what is this hula balu about seeing your mother anyways? Baby, so if I don't see your mother, we won't get married. I didn't say that. I didn't say that, but look, baby, it's the right thing to do. For Christ's sakes, <laughs> not doing boyfriend and girlfriend here. It's marriage. The right thing for us to do is for you to get acquainted with my family and vice versa. That's what I'm asking for. Excuse me, I have to go. Right here. Is it okay? Yeah, it's okay, son. You know, I don't really, I don't understand why you have refused to bring this beautiful girl to meet your mother. Are you all right? Yes, well, I'm okay. Look, mommy, it's just that she's she's a very busy person. You know, she's working a lot. You know, she has a lot on her hand. And but I promise that we will come and see you. You have to understand, son, that you didn't come home to have frivolous time with these girls. Okay. Yes, I will. You look thirsty. Are you thirsty? Yes, you are thirsty. Let me get you something chill to drink, okay? All right? Mama, mama. <laughs> I hope you're not diverting the subject. No, uh, I want to get you a drink for you. Madam, welcome. Sir, come here. Is my son inside? Your son? Uh, yes, he's inside. Inside the house? Yes. Uh, 
about the truth is that I've not seen him since today. That question, I don't know how to answer it. I don't know if it's with someone or without any person. In fact, I don't even understand. But the truth is that since today, I had a guy laughing, jesting, you know, as if he's discussing with someone. What a beautiful answer of Sarah's cutting. Now you will understand why the Lord said, a good man is not supposed to be alone. You're welcome to my son's house. Let's go inside. Her name is Emily. I brought her here for you to assess. Are you thinking like this? You're thinking like your thoughts emanate from the book of history. I'm a full-grown man, and how can you be bringing an, an Emily for a full-grown man to marry without even consulting me first? If it has not worked uh, before, it will not work, and it cannot work. Oh, really? Yes. A full-grown man, I gave a lot of chance, in fact, a lot of time for him to make a decision. And he couldn't make a decision as a man. Right, the one I see here is the one that needs guideline. So I took a step to bring you a beautiful wife. Dear full-grown mom, you didn't do well. By bringing this girl to come and marry me. I've told you, I have a woman I want to marry. I love her. We are seeing already, we are headed towards marriage like this. It's not even what, what, it's not even what Tom and Jerry um, people are, are doing anymore now. Really? Yes. Oh, a girl that has vehemently refused to see your mother. A girl whose low self esteem has not allowed her to face your mother. Simply because she knows that she cannot pass my scrutiny. Tom, enough, please. Enough. You want to see my wife? You would see her in the due time. But as quick as possible, you would see her. But let this decision end right now. Biko, can it end? Please. That's why I brought Emily here to be your wife. And I will pay her transport back. Thank you. You are not serious. You bring a wife for a full grown man. Who does that? What up? Your mother was right. You can't marry a woman who doesn't want to have anything to do with you or your family. And who said anything about her not having anything to do with me and my family members? Where did you get that from? Well, you said it yourself. I never did. Well, you did. You said she doesn't want to be seen anywhere outside with you. You said she's never gone to see any of your family members. Come to think of it, she's never made any of your friends. First of all, my woman is an introvert. Okay? And I am not marrying her for you, my friend, or any of my friends, or my mother, my f for, for, for nobody. She's my wife, and I'm marrying her for me, myself, and I. I heard you. I, okay, fine. Great. I, I, just, I just hope you're not making a mistake. Okay? Okay, can we change the topic? 
Yeah, I want something chill to drink. I know somewhere. So let's go. So you don't have a drink in your office. You want something? Yeah, like poor man. Make sure it's worth it too. After you, Mr. Man. Alright, this way. Brother man. Brother. <laughs> Cheers. You can see the much more standard. I know, right? Mmm. <laughs> That's the way I like it. I told you. Fantastic. It's always very cold around here. Mm -hmm. Yes, you were telling me about your interest in acquiring uh, an already developed event center. Oh, yeah. Um, you can show me something off your catalog, right? Yeah, sure. I, I took some pictures and I have them on my phone. You can scroll through if you don't mind. Yeah, just go through. Okay. Yeah, this is nice. Mm. This is nice. Oh, you know, I need something bigger. Keep scrolling. There's one with a very vast compound there. What area? Uh, same place you want. Okay. Yeah. What is it? Oh, <laughs> you know her? Well, that's um, <clears throat> one of my fishes, if you understand what I mean. <laughs> you know. Where is she? Uh -uh. Where is she? Oga? Samata? Oga? Samata? Oga? Where is she? Where, 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 where is she? Eh? Oga? Where is who is she? Who, where, who, where, who, where, who is she? Who, who, where, who is she? Aha. Where? I thought I said this room away people they talk say my Oga feed on the crazy very, in fact, my Oga don't the crazy. Now now they confirm saying not true. How about you go from this side? Drop, I see rich here. Cho, 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 cho. Ah, ah. They say, where is she, where is she? Who, where, who is she? Ah, ah, ah. Who, 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 ah. She said she, she said, say, him lock this door. How am I sure that? I said it. Where is she, where is she? Since you entered that side, let me enter this side. Where is, who, 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 where, who, where is she? Where is she? Zapata! 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 Hi, honey. Honey? What's going on with you and my friend Lancelot? Your friend? Don't give me that look. I saw the pictures. I saw you kissing him on my bed. What's going on? Take it easy, honey. An innocent kiss will do no harm. to think it's time we unravel the puzzle. What, 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 what puzzle?
Uh, welcome, ma. Is my son in? Your son? Yes. Uh, he, yes, he just drove in. So why all that uh, distraction? Excuse me. for this for this house it's my son he, yes he just drove in and he, now you're asking me what is the meaning of this 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 eh? did I give wrong answer or did I give incorrect answer now my miss they buy bank they supply oil give country I come here not no no insult one or they take Did you say Zapata what? Are you, are you okay? Did you say Zapata? I, th I thought you'd be cured of this hallucination. Did it start again? Uh, sorry. Mom, um, I think what's going to happen here is I would need you guys to get to know yourself. Come on, sit, come on, sit down there. What is wrong with you? There's no one here. Who are you talking to? Don't mom me and tell me what is wrong with you. Baby. Baby. Oh, come on, will you come back here? Baby. After I say come back here, where are you going to? Of course now. So what you've caused now? Why? Huh? She even greeted you for, 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 for Christ's sake. She, she greeted you. What is all this? Do you have fever? Are you okay, mom? I want to know if you have the high temperature. I should be asking you. What is wrong with you, son? I, I know now because she's not Emily. She's not Emily. That's, that, 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 that's why you're, 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 you're doing all this drama. Just, it's not right. Just keep quiet. I don't know what you're talking about. She was even greeting you and you, you, you ignored her. Why? Could you please come down? Are you, do, you, do you have fever? you have a headache? Mom, stop it now. Stop it. Isn't that, that, that that's Emily here that you brought here that, 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 that's now wife, wife material? See if I here, here greeting you. I don't see. Get it. What are you talking about? Get quiet! What could be wrong with my son? Did he start doing drugs? I know he used to hallucinate when he was younger, but he got good medical attention. Son, I will not lose you. Since he came back to Nigeria, he has been behaving strange. Something must be wrong with him. I must lay my hand on whatever it is. Oh God, please save my son. Please. How did he know her? They couldn't have met overseas because she never mentioned it to me. There is something sinister somewhere. I must find whatever it is before it finds me and unravels my secret. 
For everybody has a secret, and not every secret is revealed. I said it. I said it. I, 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 I think I said it that these people, they will finally spoil this particular light. Now it's not showing. Huh? Eh? What kind of nonsense is this? And nobody will accept that he or she is the he, 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 he is the one that spoiled the thing. Nonsense. Ah. Uh -uh. Quit, 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 what is all this now? What is, what, what is, what is, what is, what is the problem? So one cannot, one cannot have peace in this house. Eh? Or is it composite that whosoever that leaves this country, if you leave this our country, travel to white man's country, when you go there, you, that's, enjoy yourself with coke. And when you enjoy yourself with coke, you just go mad, come back and be, and just be, be, be and just be, be misbehaving. Eh? Why is this man shouting all alone, talking to himself all alone? Because I'm very, very sure that my guy is all alone in that house. No, Columbus, I must go there to find out what the problem is. Which kind of sense is this? No, no, no. Columbus, Mind your business, uh, I beg. Everybody, carry your cross. All my lamb, carry your kettle. Because this guy shout, where they shout there now. If I go there and I slap, and they just come out. I might go back to my former destination. I'm going back. I love you too. Good morning, my Prince Charming. You need to stop badging in on me like that. A ghost. Is that what ghosts do? Anyways, come go get dressed. Yeah. And by the way, you need to stop coming <laughs> to my mind. Let's go. <laughs> Yes, you look good. Perfect. <laughs> Anything else? Do I need to pick something? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, one more fun. thing. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, I don't want. Oh, I don't want. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I don't get it. No, I just don't understand. You never gave me the chance to explain myself. You just punched me in the face and left. She was my ex-girlfriend. I loved her. But things didn't work out between us, so she left. <laughs> you don't believe him, Adelon. He's lying. So why do I have a feeling you're lying? Why would I lie to you? You're my bosom friend. Well, that girl is my woman. The girl I want to marry. No, wait, I don't understand. I don't understand too. No, wait, is that the same about her you kept talking about? Yes, the same one. So why don't you start by explaining to me what she is doing in your phone and both of you on my bed, for Christ's sake. I sold that house to you, remember? Oh, you didn't tell me that you lived in the house before selling the house to me? Yeah, well, sometimes when I run low on cash, I just use that place, you know, for any fish I catch. The fish you catch? Well, you don't refer to human beings as fishes. Okay, I heard you. Fine. Sorry. But, uh, I didn't get it. How, 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 how can you say you've seen her when she's, uh... You mean dead? No, I didn't say. It's supposed to be resting in peace. 
right? Not visiting a human like me. I never said that. I was just, you know. Can we go to my house, yeah? I need to clear some things with you. I'm in the car. Well, I have been in this house for long, and the only thing staring at me are the walls. Besides you, of course. Oh, you know I get edgy. When I ask you a question and you keep me waiting without providing a sincere answer to a simple question. Welcome to the battle. That question is not for me, Brother Lee. Brother Lee? Brother Lee? Yeah? Well, she was a girlfriend, right? Yeah. So why don't you start by telling me what happened between the both of you? <laughs> Wait, no way. Are you insinuating that I murdered her? Did you? You just said it yourself. An insinuation, a suggestive statement that leads to a conclusion that she is dead, she is no more. So why don't you save us the time and tell me what happened to Zapata? Where is she? Avalon, something tells me he won't oblige you with the truth. So, what should I do? Pressure him. I should work. Put some fears on him and see the outcome. Fine. Uh, now, now, Avalon, please, just, just hold on. Uh, are you sure this your hallucinating thing is not getting out of hand? Maybe you should just go see a doctor or better still travel abroad. You're saying I'm mad. Huh? You're trying to say I'm insane. No. Are you trying to say that I am mad? No, no, no. I'm slut. No. And I'm going insane, right? No, what, what I'm just simply saying is that which man in his right senses would, would see a ghost and claim to be in love That's with a her? a ghost. A ghost? Yeah. How do you think she's a ghost? A ghost is a dead person. You just told me that she's a ghost, which means that you think she's dead. How did she die? Did you kill her? You killed her, right? Huh? This is the end of the road for you, my brother. Where's that brother? The police outside. And he heard everything you said. So run! Murderer! Bloody murderer! That's what you are! Run! Brother Lee! Brother Lee! How could you do this to me? Huh? How could you do this to me? Run! Yes, run! No, 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 you run! Thank you very much. All I'll right. give you a call.
I must get to the bottom of this. Darling, what is it? I heard your voice from inside. One young boy from his voice, I could tell he's a young boy, just called me. That our daughter is no more. Ah! Chimo! Hey! Listen, I, I, I think I have to call the commissioner of police right away. Could this be why we have not heard or seen our daughter for a while? Darling, please. Please. Do not leave any stone unturned. We must get to the root of this matter. Hey! Killing a woman who gave you her heart and love, who trusted you with everything in her, it's such an odious act. You took her life as a result of my quarrel, and I want to ask, why? You see, the truth will not set you free here. It will only give you a fair legal option. But telling lies will make you die twice before the final judgment. And what are my chances that I make it out of here alive? If you tell me the truth, I can help you frame a better work that will make it third degree murder. And what happens next? I walk a free man? The question just affirms that your mother is a daughter. And my curiosity is, why? <laughs> you see, I cannot overemphasize how happy you make me feel anytime I'm around you. <laughs> you know I love you. I do. And I'm ready to give you my all. I can't wait to meet your family, darling. <sighs> of course you will be. Okay. Very soon. Okay. Lunchtime is almost over, and I have to go right away. Oh, okay. How about that? Tell us more. <laughs> Take care of yourself. All right, darling. Have a nice day. All right. You sure you want me to come with you? Guy, you bad guy. Whatever God has joined together, let no promiscuity put us under. Meal. You can say that again. Girl, you see, Lance is God sent. Hmm. For me alone. Just me. Tell me, where is this relationship headed? Where else than the permanent destination? Mm. Anyways, I wish you guys luck though. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. Raymond will come get you, okay? And then you guys will get married and live happily ever after. Amen. Amen. I can't wait, you know, I can't wait. <laughs> so, so next stop. Seafood. Yeah. Seafood. <laughs> Let's not have you, baby. <laughs> Now.
now that I have gotten into her heart, it is time to use her as a tool to milk a lot of money from her father. Senator Dr. Austin Onua Guluchi, I am coming for your money. Sounded urgent and worried. How are you doing? I'm fine. Just that um, there's this there's this building I'm looking at buying, but I don't have enough money to purchase it. You want to buy a building? Yeah. Is that all? Yeah. I thought it was something more serious. Just a building. So, how much are we talking about here? Oh, you see, honestly, it's going to be costing about 75 million naira to acquire the property. But you see, after all is done and dusted, I'll be making about 135 million naira profit. Oh, honey, you know money is not a problem. Then talk to me, baby. <laughs> I will transfer 25 million naira to your account from my business account, and I'll talk to Daddy about it to see what he can do. So. That's why I always love you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Are we good now? Yeah, just a little bit. Mm, a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Let me go fix something for you to eat. Okay. I'm sure you're hungry. Yes, I am. And when I'm done, I will come give you that special massage. <laughs> oh, mama. <laughs> come on, come on. Darling, I know she has everything, but she said she wants to try herself in real estate. Darling, please, let's give her the opportunity. You and I know that 50 million naira is nothing to you. Eh? Darling, please, for my sake, give it to her. Please. Hmm? We're talking about this million as if, no matter the inflation in this country, 50 million is still big money. Eh? I'll see what I'll do about it. Hey! You are the best darling in the wide mm. world. One more thing. Your father won the contract you told me about. No. Oh, maybe he's decided to give me the said five million naira. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, 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 fine, fine. I give up. I give up. Okay. Ta -da! I am um, <laughs> No, it's not that. Uh, it's just that. Um... It is what? <sighs> baby, this is what every couple prays for. And we need this baby as much as our parents need to be grandparents. The best we can do is to hasten the wedding. No, it's just, you see, on the contrary, we are really not ready. Okay? So? So you terminate it? No. No, no, baby, no. No, I, 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 I can't tell him. No, I can't tell him, my baby. You want me to... <sighs> baby. Baby, look baby, I have five million naira I can't spare for the wedding. And if you really do love me, 
And let's do it. Baby. Come on, baby. A very pathetic story you got there. Interesting, though. So tell me, what happened to the pregnancy? After I discovered she got pregnant, I... I didn't know what to do. I just knew my game was up, so... I asked her to terminate the pregnancy. Uh, you told me she was ready to do anything to keep her relationship with you. Well, the focus here wasn't about the love we shared, but about the money I needed from her. Are you for real? Luke chapter 10 verse 19 says that whatever God has joined together, let no man put asunder. The pregnancy was the asunder, so I decided to get rid of it. Zapata! Zapata! I'm talking to you and you're walking away. I just asked you a question. Now about that thing in your womb, what are your plans? Don't refer to my unborn child as a thing. Okay, fine. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I, I love you, but you see, I cannot go on with this. All right, I have a child and I have a wife. I mean, if, if you feel we have to go on with this relationship, our purpose for this relationship has been achieved already. So why don't we just end it? What are you talking about, Master? Well, what I am trying to say is that I have a wife and kid at home. I cannot bring myself to tell my wife that another woman has a child for me. Okay, so if you if we must continue with this relationship, you have to find something to do with that thing. You get rid of it. have a wife and a son? That's not. After all I have done for you, after all I did for you, Lancelot, and you stand there, you have the guts and the temerity to stand there, look to my face and tell me to get rid of our baby, my own child. You want to ruin my life. You want to mess around with my emotions. But you know what, men? You are a joke. Because I won't let you toy with my heart. I'm going to tell Father about this. And you know what he's definitely going to do to you. Don't you think your wife will be so disappointed in you? Listen, all I know is that my wife has been on the side of me. And whatever extreme measures I have taken to make her is to take care of her. And now you've landed yourself in this top world. How do you face her?
Roma or for Molite school. Your husband will kill someone. Don't worry. By the time you finish with that, God will be sad. Follow me. You didn't do it. Tell me it's a lie, please, my husband. Avalon must have killed that girl and framed me for it. But they said you testified to be responsible for her death. Me? Baby, talk to me. Tell me you didn't do it, please. Please. Mother, as you already know, your husband has been accused for the murder of one base, Zapata Chapel Austin. Have you lived with your husband for years? Is he the kind of man who could do anything like that? I mean, what have you noticed about him? Any strange happenings in the house that you can remember? My husband cannot force a fly because he's catch on his food. He can't. Madam, listen. You have to be honest here. Because your honesty will go a long way in helping your husband. I will show you this. Have you seen this girl before? Anywhere at all? Jesus Christ. Who are you? And what are you doing on my matrimonial bed? I am talking to you. I say, Jesus Christ. Jesus. Honey? Honey? Just look at. Look, look at this foul play. What did he do that they gave him record now? Honey, I saw a ghost, a young face, skinny on our bed. I wanted you to approach her. She, she disappeared. <laughs> My dear, you have had a stressful day. I'm sure it is the stress that is making you have headache and hallucinate. Okay? Honey, I know what I'm saying. I know what I'm saying. Where is Tony? You, you went to pick him up from school, right? Yes, he should be in his room changing. Relax, My dear, relax. Honey, I'm worried. Give me my ball. Auntie, give me my ball. Yes, Dad. Who is holding your ball? You tell her to give me my ball. Who? She's holding my ball. Well, your ball is right there. Tony, I told you to take a shower before coming outside. Anytime. 
Huh? I can't even see the person. Look, I told you, go take a shower, have your breakfast, and then you can come outside and have fun. Who are you talking to? One strange lady came. And that is exactly the picture of the young lady your husband got. Baby, baby, is not true. Baby, is not true. Baby, is a lie. Look at me. Baby, is a lie. Look, look, is not look, true. Sarah, look, just, 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 just get me a lawyer, okay? I need a lawyer to get me out of here. Okay? See how the cookie is crumbled. Sarah, Baby. I need a lawyer to get me out of here. Get me a lawyer right now. Okay? And what makes you think I will collect the 10 million naira? Inspector, everybody needs money. Even the rich needs more money. Okay? You want me to say it? Fine, I'll say it. Please. Okay? Please get me out of here. Huh? Everyone has a price. But I refuse to be cheap. How about this? How about what? Another crime, Mr. Lancelot. Trying to bribe an officer of the law. Your kind is really not worthy to be found in the street. And I will make sure you will be in a solitary jail. Finally. Nemesis has caught up with you, Mr. Lancelot. Hello. So you weren't invited back home to come for ghost hunting? What are, what are you talking about? What is about is that you're supposed to get married, settle down, and continue with this family lineage. I'm not getting younger. Can't you see it, son? What is wrong with you? Mom, the plan hasn't changed. The plan has changed. It has changed since you started believing and started living under the illusion of being in love with a ghost. What is wrong with you? You are supposed to get married. Get involved in your father's business. To continue with this lineage. Take authority over your father's business. But you are not doing that. Well, what? the plan hasn't changed. The plan has changed, son. If you are not ready to take authority over your father's business, I will sell off that business, sell off his properties, and give it to the orphanage. That is what your mother would do. Yes, uh, DPO, I want you to put that young man behind bars. Put, her in your, <laughs> put him in your cell. There should be no food, no water, or anything. Nobody should visit him. How could he, how could he kill my own daughter? And I've been looking for her for the past two weeks. No news about her, nothing. And now I lay my hands on him and somebody is telling me not to deal with him. I want you to put him behind bars and I am here to stand. To say I am the one that told you to do it. I am going to give you any amount you want. Any amount that you need. Make sure that nobody sells him food, no water, nothing. Let them torture him in that cell. Yes. He's, he's very stupid. He didn't only kill my daughter, but he burnt her. Is it not annoying? How else can you provoke somebody? I want you to deal with him. Make sure you carry out my orders. I'll see you for it. I'll compensate you. Yes. Don't worry. I'll, I'll come over to the police station very soon. Good. Barrister, I, I want you to do all within your powers to make sure that uh, that 
idiot called Lancelot huh. spends the rest of his miserable life behind that. No problem, sir. I will do my best. Please, Barrister. This is our only daughter we are talking about here. My husband and I will give anything just to get justice for our daughter. Like I said before, I will do my best in the court. Good. I just hope that this is not a ploy to, to derail my political ambition. If it is, I must crush the picture. Ah! Cut! After cross-checking the testimonies for and against the suspect for the killing of Ms. Zapata Champagne Austin, and after proper examination of the submissions made by the prosecuting and defense counsels, this is my judgment. Mr. Lancelot Equibe committed the crime and is hereby found guilty of Section A, Subsection C of the Criminal Code, Cap 23, Law of Federal Republic, 2015. I hereby sentence him to life imprisonment. Cut. All right. Right. Son, I'm so sorry. Thank you for making your mother proud. I am so sorry for not trusting you. I love you, sir. I love you so much. I love you too. What happens next? Sabata's death has been avenged. Will it bring her back to me? She leave never to be seen again. <sighs> I wish I can also die or do whatever I can so we can meet up and be together in the other world. Hello, sir. She would have appreciated that so much wherever she is. Okay, sure, sure. I will, I will join you, sir. Thank you very much for the call.
Why are you sad, my love? I'm not supposed to be happy now that you know Lancelot is put behind bars. Yes, I am happy. But you see, in a little while, I will no longer be with you. For I would be laid to rest in peace. It's gonna make me so sad. You will never completely be at home again. Because part of your heart will be on the lookout for me. The pleasures of loving and knowing someone from a different world. Now it's going to be my punishment. I will always be with you. I will always be there for you. Because you are a good man. To go to the site where that young man burnt the remains of my daughter. We want to take sons from there and come back and give my daughter a befitting burial so that uh, her soul may rest in peace. Well, that would be very good of you to do, sir. Uh, but let me ask have you informed Avalon about this? Oh, yes. Yes, he's aware. As a matter of fact, my wife and I have concluded plans on how to compensate him for giving us the lead to unraveling this uh, mystery. Okay. All right. All right, sir. In that case, uh, may the good Lord give you the fortitude to be at the irreplaceable loss. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. Are we going to stand to you? Yeah, of course. Namaste, Father. Amen. Amen. 